I'm in Thornton uh, Heath uh, at a fantastic day talking about the great strengths that the area has as people living there are rediscovering for themselves. And Patrick Harrison is just showing me uh, some history of the area. Um, and Patrick, you've been here for uh, 40 years or so. And um, what have you seen change? Um, people, business. The business has changed dramatically in Thornton Heath. There's a lot, there's a lot less diversity of business um, in the area as we had in the past. And that has a dramatic effect on employment um, and so forth. So that's one of the dramatic changes in, in the area that um, we're, we're no longer having employment locally. And that's um, a, a, great, uh, a great shame. Yeah. And you've been involved, uh, I think, in the project which has been going on over the last few months here. What's your part been in that? Um, many of the ideas um, that have been very... Um, some of the ideas that's coming up and events that's taking place next year with some of the stuff that I bring forward, like the history of Thornton Heath, that's the idea um, of mine, and a few other things that uh, we're working on as well. We've been focusing a lot on how to help people make better connections in the area and perhaps recapture some of the connections that they had. Were relationships stronger in the past in the area than they have been in recent years? I think so, yes, yeah, very much, very much so. People much more, because I think with what's happened over the years, there's a, there's a lot more. We have a lot more people coming from overseas, and uh, they're not really connected, and they're not quite connected with uh, the, the people who are here in, in the past. So the communities have changed dramatically. So we just need to re reconnect once more with, with those people who have, moved, who have moved in to the area. Yeah. I just saw you looking at the map over there a bit earlier. Can you show me what's on it? Oh, sure, sure, sure. Well, this road here, which is Northwood Road, originally the name of that was Leather Bottle Lane, uh, hold the famous Leather Bottle Pub. And I think Dick Turpin used to ride down this road uh, many years ago. And up Spar Hill was actually called the Great Northwoods rather than Spar Hill. So that's really quite an interesting thing. Um, and this roundabout is an interesting roundabout because I believe it's the only roundabout that you can go around it both ways. <laughs> That's very interesting. And I think the dots on here are about uh, where people live and where they're willing to get involved. And uh, we've got quite a, quite a few dots. There's quite a few dots of local um, um, historical sites. Also, there are some community, community groups that's, 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 that's based on the, in those dots as well. We've been having some great discussions about people's hopes for the area, and this afternoon we're going to see what can be done about it.